Guten Morgen. Hi, everybody. I'm Victor Brick, and welcome to today's Good Old Uncle Vic. I'm here with my lovely wife, Lynn. Good Morgen. In Zellumsee, Austria, in the heart of the Alps. Behind us is the Kitzsteinhorn, I think that's how you say it, the Kitzsteinhorn Glacier. And this is the Selim Sea. It's formed by the glacier. And yesterday, and we're staying at the Salzburger Hof, where we had a day of beauty yesterday as uh, health treatments. And the day before, we were up in uh, Badgestein, which is a skiing resort. We didn't ski, but we went to the thermal baths. And we're here in Austria for a uh, roundtable meeting that Lynn and I sp spoke at in Vienna. And we came here up to the Alps to uh, after a, after a business meeting to kind of decompress and to try to relax and and, uh, and not only enjoy Austria but also to kind of recharge our, our, ourselves. In Chinese philosophy, if you're familiar with the concept of Qigong or Feng Shui, you know about the Yin, the Yin, and the Yang. The Yin is soft. The Yang is hard. The Yin is water. The Yang is fire. The yin is um, meditation and reflection. The yang is physical activity. And too many of us spend most of our time in the yang. And we, we're always driving to work, we're working, we're working out. Even when we recreate, we're doing physical activities and active activities. Lynn and I are the same way. And you want to try to balance the yin and the yang in your life. You want to have some yin every day and sometimes like the last couple of days you want to really try to get get back and and, and, and recharge yourself by spending a, a concentrated period of time on the yin so that's what Lynn and I did this last couple of days we tried to spend have a, a yin retreat a yin relaxation a yin vacation as opposed to so much yang activity we're back here in Vienna in front of the Mozart monument for the Uncle Vic thought for the day. And the thought for today, in honor of the Beatles' 50th anniversary of coming to the United States, is a scene from the movie A Hard Day's Night. And in the scene, Ringo Starr is taking care of Paul McCartney's grandfather. And Ringo's, Ringo's reading a book, a book. And Paul's grandfather says, look at you with that blooming book. And Ringo says, you can learn from books. And Paul's grandfather says, you can learn from books, but you can learn more by parading and exploring. Take it from me. You can learn from books, but you can learn a lot more by parading and exploring. That's it. I got to go. Got a ballet to catch. Until we meet again, that's it from good old Uncle Vic.